Hello, my name is William Hollingsworth. I'm the fire chief in Cambria, California. In the field of emergency medical services, there are different levels for, of training for those who provide care. Sometimes there is confusion between the terms first responder, EMT, and paramedic. Everybody who works in the 911 field is a first responder. This is a general term that refers to all emergency personnel who respond to any type of emergency. This can be a local, large scale, or large disaster. In the field of emergency medical care, there are two levels of training. This is EMT and paramedic. Both EMTs and paramedics have the ability to render care. The biggest difference between EMT and paramedic is the amount of education they received and what they are able to do for their patients. An EMT, or emergency medical technician, is the entry level of care, and it is considered the most common level of training for those in this field. EMTs learn the essentials to help in life-threatening situations, and their level of training is the foundation for all level of trainings for EMS personnel that work in the field. EMTs usually receive about 150 hours of required training to maintain the certification. A paramedic is a specialized healthcare provider that can do everything that has been trained to do everything that an EMT can do, plus a num number of other things. They're able to initiate IVs, they're able to administer medication, and utilize advanced airway management. To become a paramedic, it takes approximately 1,800 hours of training. 